Hello, my name is Simeon Neil Asher, and the trigger point of the week this week is the tensor fascia lata, or the TFL muscle. So let's search in my exciting new software, lumbo pelvic hip thigh, and let's just search for tensor fascia lata, and there we are. Okay, so the fascia lata is this um, band, or the iliotibial uh, band, that runs down um, all the way down the sort of lateral part of the uh, thigh, um, sort of preventing sort of varus uh, or, or sort of lateral shift through the, the, the thigh itself. Um, thick, strong myofascial band, and the TFL, the, trans, the, the tensor fascia lata, is anterior. It takes its origin from the uh, sort of lower part of the anterior superior iliac spine, ACIS, and it inserts just below the trochanter into and blends with the fascia of the fascia lata. Um, it's a kind of slightly antagonist with, uh, with glute maximus. Glute max is the posterior part and inserts into the fascia lata lower down. So they kind of work antagonistically together. Uh, hugely important muscle in terms of runner's knee and lateral thigh pain. If we look at the pain map together, you'll see that there's uh, sort of pain around the outside of the hip. Um, so sort of hip pain to be sort of differentially diagnosed with uh, something like trochanteric bursopathy or bursitis. Um, and also uh, the quadratus lumborum, the QL can refer there. So good to take a good history and look if there's any kind of mechanical factors such as running, which are involved in thigh pain, uh, in the knee pain. So um, in terms of things like foam rollers, um, I'm not gonna pass judgment on foam rollers, but the evidence is against uh, perhaps the idea of lengthening. Um, what is, I think, true is that foam rolling does change the modify the symptoms. So symptom modification, which I think is hugely relevant in terms of the way trigger points work anyway. So I wouldn't say foam rolling, I'm not against it, but I don't think it works in quite the way other people uh, sort of are, are preaching. Um, so why, but, but why is it important? Because um, what can happen is as people run, they start to develop a larger sort of vastus lateralis. In fact, if we, if we look at the quads now, let's see if we can find the vastus lateralis. Um, it's the lateral vastus lateralis here. So, so we can see that they, they sort of share a kind of uh, a band, uh, a map of pain in terms of the, the lateral part of the quads. Uh, that inserts into the sort of lateral part of the ligamentum patelli. So why is that important? Because the TFL, or the sorry, the fascia lata sits on top of the lateral uh, of uh, quads. And what can happen is as the muscle starts to grow, you literally get a pressure effect where the, the TFL, where the, the fascia lata is, is tight, incompressible, and starts to actually press into that muscle. And what we then start to feel is a taut band, a very specific taut band, just anterior uh, to this fascia lata uh, as we come down and it's around about here and it's absolutely pathognomonic. You can roll your, just if you feel down the, the, the band, you, you just, the iliotibial band and just roll slightly anteriorly, you'll feel this long thin um, sort of myofascial uh, taut band in part of the, the vastus uh, lateralis. And, and usually treating that area there has a hugely important effect, both on the TFL and in terms of sort of runner's knee and knee pain. Um, in, in terms of the TFL itself, uh, we, we usually treat it a lot higher than you think, sort of higher and anterior. It's, you, it's okay, you can actually grab it uh, on, on people and actually sort of work it in a pincer technique to, to work the trigger points there. So that's the tensor fascia lata or the fascia lata. Um, the, the TFL, as we said, uh, hip pain, lateral thigh pain, very much associated with runner's knee, uh, uh, part of the, the complex between the, the, the glute max and the TFL itself, and uh, lends itself beautifully to trigger point work. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that video and we really look forward to seeing you again uh, next week. Thanks for watching. Bye.